I've just got a little Christmas set up here. I thought I might just have another go at it for you. I did one and I thought, you know, people might like just to see how this happens, how easily it can happen if you just are relaxed and just let it happen. It's a little um, poinsettia still life thing. It's one of those little pots you put around at Christmas, which is really nice. I'll go quite quickly so that you can see how I do it. And then I'll even put the color on for you, the way I do color. It's pretty loose. And I don't mind if it doesn't look exactly like the thing anyway. It's just, it's got quite a few of these petally things. And it's got some holly coming out the side. I've changed it a bit because I've just got to fit it into this little space down here. And I'll do another one there. And then I'll do the little, I'll just make it up really. Just where I think things look good. Then the pot comes down here. I'll do it on an angle towards where I am at the moment. Maybe another leaf out there would be good. Okay, put that up there. Pretty crazy, but I'll I'll let that be now. While I'm on the case, I'll sign it. I like to sign them right at the moment I do them that are part of your design, part of you. All right, now for some paint. It's gonna be pretty quick because it just will be just pretty quick. Now I'm gonna use a little bit of yellow ochre first because there's people who work with me now. It's, to me, it's an undercoat. It gives me a base for where I might want to put color. It doesn't mean to say everything's going to be yellow. It won't be. We'll be red next. Cadmium red. Let's try the cadmium red. Nice pure colour. We'll drop it on where the petals are. There, there, there. Anywhere I can see them. But keep them loose. Don't try and fill in the lines and go right up to the edges of them. Just let them drop on. You're not really trying to make a matching thing that's thing in front of you, just doing a little bit of a fun impression. Just to enjoy yourself, that's all it's about. Having a little bit of fun. Lots of other things that might need to be done, but today, nope. It's Boxing Day. That's the day after Christmas for us. And I'm having a lovely time just not doing anything in particular. Just playing around. A little bit of permanent rose. I'm rather fond of that. It does actually bring a little bit of extra to that red. Because if you take a look at red, it isn't just one colour. It's lots of colours. There's even quite dark purpley things in there. But, you know, we're not trying to do anything botanical here. A bit of the blue sap green would be good. Might need a bit more pigment back to the little thing, add a bit more paint when you need it. Felt like some in there now. I'll do the little blue pot. It's really white but I just use a bit of wash of blue just to give it some form. Well, it seems to work alright. Then I really ought to put the yellow stamens in but there's rather a lot of other paint there right now. That's the kind of thing I can go back later and do if I really want. I'll see if I can do some anyway. Just to show there is some yellow in there. Oh, it'll might start mixing in a minute. That's fine. Just fine. Then I'm going to put a little bit of what I call the sitting down line. A bit wobbly because I'm actually standing to do this. Sometimes you've just got to do things from whatever angle you're on. And a tiny little bit of cerulean around the top. That'll be it. Where's my cerulean? It's over here. There we go. In there. In there. Just a bit of fun. There. Done. Have a go at that. I think you'll find that's quite, quite a nice little exercise. It won't matter really how it comes out, but it's just a Christmassy thing. Something that just reminds me of the day and the lovely time we're having. I'll chat to you soon. Bye.